reporter, why is it you want to become an American? You want to take it. No, it's going to be on bad, he said. Don't you think she should expand on that answer a little bit? I think she could. Mm -hmm. uh, Don't you shy you shy of the camera? No. <laughs> Very exciting day, huh? I think if you're there, you should be American. Is that the only reason, mate? Come. No. Because the children are American. What benefits are there for you, you think? I don't know. There might be. Along the road. Along the road. Can't you remember what we do? Uh, well, when I had it done it was 20 years ago, oh. as I recall, the judge just gives a speech of some kind and then asks everybody to sign and take an oath of allegiance to the United States. Oh. All jointly together. Yeah, it's very straightforward. And that's good. And I, but I always do, what I do remember as a ceremony is that... Uh, oh.
Now we're on record. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Cool. What's it feel like to be in the It feels great. In no way is it different. Tell me the truth. You don't see it. Because you don't you see it. Really you do? Yes. I feel happier. <laughs> <laughs> American citizenship brought you infinite happiness. Wow. You know that's going in your eyes. <laughs> it's the light. Don't look at don't look at the light just like you don't look no. at the sun. You don't have to look directly into the camera. You can talk. You don't have to look at the camera. Oh, you don't have to look you at the camera. You can look at your husband. Oh. Either. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Love David was here. Oh, yeah. Have you anything more to tell us? No? No, I've en really enjoyed it. Have you? I thought the ceremony was very, very, very yeah. nice, very moving, yeah. I thought it was. Are you going to come with me when I have to come in the West Citizen? Do you want to? You <laughs> <laughs> don't like any of us. No, I'm afraid I don't like folks in the ceremony. That's the English man. Are you going to come well, sit I'm here now, David? Okay. Yes. And just want to sit down, just without moving the camera, look through the viewfinder and okay. make sure we're both in it. Oh, yeah, make sure we're both in it. And just don't look at the light, look at him. Turn the light on. Yes, yeah. you're both in it. Okay. Yeah. Um. Oh, David's going back. Yes, we'll David. See you again. David's going yes, back to. Do Jolly old DC. Yeah. And uh Jolly old DC. No. Sure, it's a nice city. When are we gonna see you again, David? Do we know? <laughs> when it cools down in Fort Myers. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's a little bit of wind. <laughs> Florida is uh, a nice place to be in the winter time. Yes, it is. Yeah. <laughs> but in the summertime I remember when I was traveling here in nineteen seventy eight for SCC, traveling up and down the state. And I remember it being incredibly hot, and everywhere I went, I had dentists and uh, doctors receptionists yelling at me because they'd not been paid for their Medicare. Yeah. So I had to pay for the hot weather and irate audiences all over the state. The situation is not today. It's not <laughs> today. It's not changing. And SCC always had a policy of paying nursing homes first because they had political clout in the state legislature, whereas individual doctors and dentists did not. So if there was any kind of billing problems and money problems, the nursing homes always got, got paid first. Yeah, you mm -hmm. used to do that, didn't you? That so, was a long while ago, SCC, wasn't it? We have to get your mother an ID now, don't we? Yes, and a frame, a frame for, for the, I want a frame, and I want that other one on the wall. Of, David. I've got two in the bedroom. Yes, did I did I say one was difficult to put up because of the frame? Yes. Yeah. But well, it can go on that small. Well, 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 what do you think of the ceremony that you had? Do you, do you I thought the ceremony was excellent. 400 people? Yes, two and a half hours. Mm. And I thought it was very, very nice and very smooth. Mm. Yes, yeah, great. Yeah. And of course, it, it was the first for you too, David, wasn't it? <laughs> Not exactly. No. I had the uh, pleasure of becoming an American citizen, American citizen, let's say, in the fall of 1979. But that, so that's years, what I meant yeah. by the question was, you've seen it now in all its glory, all the yeah. ceremony. I've always said that since I became an American citizen, I'd like to quote or paraphrase uh, 
young Kennedy on his visit to Ireland during his final summer of life in 1963. And when he got off the plane in Dublin, he said, this is not the land of my birth, but it is the land for which I hold the greatest affection. And that's what I like to say about the United States. It's not the land of my birth, but it is the land for which I hold the greatest affection. Why does that not surprise you? And that is and he got about the great time for why because he don't that's one thing yeah, which I don't think my amount of in England, you know. I think they go a lot of things you say that are not available in England. Yeah. Well if I would have been a blue blood, there would have been plenty of them oh, yeah. at that particular time. And it has gotten better in that regard. But when I was there, it wasn't very good. Do you know what blood group you are? And I had no idea. Well, I, I mean, he went to Now, can you put this interview on to a more ethereal level? Can, can you be Ted Koppel, make it a little bit more esoteric instead of these mundane questions? Yes. <laughs> this is to test your interview skills. If you want to be a journalist, you've got to have good interview skills. That, 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 well, I haven't got a script. Yeah. Yeah. 